Optional Equipment for CNC Milling Machines. In this video, we will tell you about optional equipment for CNC milling machines and find out how they work and what they are used for when machining material. This is Watson. Welcome to the world of CNC machines. Vacuum Table. The vacuum table presses the workpiece onto the working area of the machine through special holes. Design presses the workpiece over the entire area, preventing it from shifting and subsequent rejects. Leaves no splits or cracks, unlike clamps. Fast and easy clamps the material to the work table. Aspiration system. The aspiration system is an industrial stationary dust extractor with a corrugator and brush that are attached to the spindle. The system sucks chips and dust into a special bag during operation. Advanced aspiration systems not only clean the workplace but also filter the air. DSP controller. The DSP controller is a remote controller connected to the machine. While the machine is running, you can adjust program parameters, increase or decrease spindle speed, set the zero point, stop the program, run the layout from a USB stick. With it, there is no need for a separate computer to control your CNC router. Coolant system. Coolant system is used when working on metals to prevent overheating of the tool and material. A specific liquid, such as water, oil, or emulsion, is supplied to the milling point through a nozzle. It is then driven back through a groove along the machine housing to a pump where it is filtered and fed back into the working area. Rotary device. The rotary device allows the milling and engraving of cylindrical workpieces, expanding the capabilities of the machine. The milling machine becomes a versatile automation unit with the advantages of a lathe. The rotary device makes it possible to produce furniture legs, columns, balusters, chess pieces, souvenirs. Automatic tool change. All tool changes are automatic with no operator intervention. All you need to do when using an automatic tool change system is to select the tool according to the machining program, install it in the tool nests, set the settings, and start the program. Tool Height Sensor button. The tool height sensor is used to detect tool height in the Z-axis. It operates by closing the contact when the tool touches the metal plate of the sensor. It facilitates tool changes and is easy to use. The sensor is resistant to mechanical stress, chips, and coolant. Gantry Leveling System. The system automatically aligns the gantry along the Y-axis. If the gantry is not aligned, it is not perpendicular, which can lead to jamming of one of the drives and skipping steps. We have told you about eight options to make working on milling machines easier and simpler. If you still have questions, feel free to contact our engineers. Write in the comments what else you would like to know about milling machines. Give us a like if the video was useful. This is Watson. See you in the next videos.